Hey guys, this is Scott Leroy, Scott Leroy Marketing, coming in for another weekly tip. And today's tip is actually a, a pretty simple one. It's one of my favorite ones, actually, of how you can add, or basically bulk add, contacts over to your smart plans. Now, a lot of people will reach out all the time saying, you know, oh, when I try to add a smart plan, it only allows me to add up to 20 at a time. And although that is correct as of right now in the back end of the smart plan section, you can actually go through your contacts and add up to 500 at a time instead. All right, so the first thing you'd always wanna do in this case is make sure that you have your smart plan active. And in this case, what I mean by active is you just happen to have it set up under your plans, all right? So we're under the My Smart Plan section, we wanna see the people plans, and we wanna make sure that we have the contact, or sorry, the smart plans added on here. Now, the plans will not be active unless you have any contacts added on here. So even though I have my plans added over to my smart plan section, they're not technically doing anything right now because I don't have any contacts on here. Now, obviously one route, much like I was talking about before, where you can add contacts is via the add contact button on the right hand side. And if I do that, it'll allow me to add up to 20 at a time. So I only have 12 contacts inside of my database right now. So in this case, I'd be able to add all of them immediately, so this really wouldn't affect me too much. Now, if you have a larger database, this is where it's really going to play a, a very important and crucial role, all right? Because instead of going through 20 at a time, I can actually click on the contacts option up here at the top left. And once I click on contacts, if you aren't viewing this of uh, showing, you know, one to 500, at the top right, we can click that show one to five or one to 10 option and change that to one to 500. All right. And now I can actually select all of my contacts. So in this case, I could select all my contacts up to 500 at a time. So if you have a database of a thousand, if you have a database of 2000, if you have a database of 355, whatever it might be, you can then select all of them. So in this case, if I have under 500, I'm showing on here. I'll be able to select them all. If I have a database of a thousand, I'd have to do this twice. So that way I can do it 500 and 500. Now, once I click on this, as we notice up here, it's going to say select bulk action. So I can click on select bulk action on here, and then I'll actually be able to see the option to add to smart plan. Now, once again, we're going to want to have our smart plan activated. So once I click on add to smart plan, now I can actually see the different smart plans that I currently have accessible under the my smart plan section to use on here. All right, so if I wanted to, I could then say, hey, for these 12 people, I wanna add them over to my quarterly call plan. So I'll click the select button, and then I can either specify, do I wanna start them now? Do I wanna actually start them on a specific date? So maybe I wanna start them instead on the fifth on here, or I can actually even stagger them too. All right, and obviously if you happen to have multiple contacts, if you're adding 500 or so at a time, it may make more sense to stagger them. All right, so then I could actually go through and say, hey, you know, if I'm doing 500 at a time, maybe I wanna do a max of 10 per day, all right? But in this case, I'm gonna start it on a specific date, and once I click that confirm button, all right, it's gonna pop up, here are the contacts I'm gonna add inside, here's my plan I'm gonna add them to, I'll click confirm, and I'm done. So your request to start, you know, this particular smart plan has been updated. And if I go back over to the smart plans applet over here on the left hand side. All right, now I'll be able to see all the eligible contacts. Now, one thing to note, though, is if you're adding, say, for instance, up to 500 contacts, if you have a larger database and you actually add 500, it may not add all of them to your smart plan. All right, it's only going to add contacts that are eligible to be added. So in this case, if you happen to have a smart plan that requires a phone number, if you have a smart plan that you're utilizing like the biweekly neighborhood nurture that requires a neighborhood, well, if they don't happen to have a neighborhood, it won't add them over the plan. All right, but now I can actually see all my contacts on the plan. I can even click this little eyeball on here and I can view everyone. So that way, if I want to unsubscribe them, if I want to go through and just unsubscribe maybe one or two people, I can. All right, completely up to you at the end of the day. So I'm gonna unsubscribe all of them to make sure this doesn't go out real quick. <laughs> all right, but that's how simple it is to bulk add contacts over to your smart plan, specifically up to 500 at a time. So there you go. So that is your KDB command tip for the day.